you are trying to launch Call of Duty Warzone, I will be using Warzone as an example, but I assume the error and the fix will be the same for most Call of Duty games. Anyway, as soon as you launch it, it throws out in DirectX error, DirectX encountered an unrecoverable error. Check the readme for possible solutions. I assume that the game has run on the same PC at least once, or the PC is capable enough to run it. So that means that you have tried all those stupid solutions you may find online, like updating or downgrading video drivers, making sure that your GPU is actually capable of using the correct DirectX version, and stuff like that. Checking and rechecking and re-downloading the game, which may be a very time-consuming process given the size of Activision titles. Anyway, you have tried all of that and that didn't help you. The most probable reason for this error is either anti-cheats for other games or any kind of overlays you are normally using while playing games. So as for the anti-cheats, the one which definitely causes problems with Warzone anti-cheats like Ricochet is the Valorant anti-cheat, which is called Vanguard. So you have to exit Vanguard before launching Warzone and see if that helps. The other big reason for these problems are numerous overlays. Almost everything nowadays has an overlay. There is a Windows overlay, there is an NVIDIA Shadowplay or whatever overlay, there is Discord overlay, there is Steam overlay, and there are also overlays for software that you use to measure FPS, frame time, and other parameters for the GPU, the most popular being MSI Afterburner. I personally have Steam overlay enabled, Nvidia overlay enabled, and I think Microsoft Game Bar overlay enabled, and Nvidia performance overlay, and none of them cause problems with Warzone. However, MSI Afterburner also secretly installs Riva Tuner statistics server, which may cause problems, and the same goes for other FPS monitoring software, like FPS Monitor. And of course, Discord has an overlay. So you may try launching Warzone with administrative privileges, but I am not a big fan of launching anything with administrative privileges, unless I really need those privileges. So instead of that, Try exiting, that means completely quitting and shutting down Discord so it doesn't run anymore, and also don't run any FPS monitoring software, and see if that helps to resolve the issue. If Warzone works just fine when you quit Discord, but you still want to use Discord, you may disable Discord overlay in Discord settings, and thus you should be able to play Warzone while still using Discord. I am the god of YouTube. Like, subscribe, thanks, jingle bells.